Hi, welcome to Natural Aesthetics. Some recent highlights of a chest session. My current training split is as follows. Monday, legs, Tuesday, shoulders, Wednesday, back, Thursday, chest and legs again. Friday, arms and abs with Saturday and Sunday as recovery. So legs will be the only body part I train twice a week. Um, the reason for that is I just feel they're a little bit downsized because of the emphasis on upper body training over the past few months. So I'm going to need a little bit of extra frequency to you know, gain a bit of volume back in the legs. And to be honest, after two weeks, I feel like they're a little bit thicker already. The reason for doing it on chest day is simply because it's probably the shortest session. You know, it's only one muscle, it's only one slab of muscle as opposed to you know, certain days where you're training multiple heads of a muscle, i.e. shoulders or, you know, back where you're hitting, you know, a big surface area and even arms, you know, biceps, triceps and forearms. So it just makes sense to get it on that day. So the exercise selection, pretty simple stuff. Dumbbell incline press, worked up with three sets of three at 45 kilos, not too much of an issue there. And a set of two at 50 kilos. Um, just really trying to increase strength, getting back into certain exercises that I haven't done in some time due to the emphasis on overhead pressing. Um, and then move on to some machine press, full stack, machine flies, full stack again, followed by some cable flies to finish. This set was a little bit too light, to be honest, before I'd add it in to go over some of the technique that I'm, I'm at least thinking about when I'm doing this. And that's not letting the shoulders round forward so they're in front of the chest. Kind of push the chest out while you're doing the flies, especially as you're meeting your hands together. Really important to keep the chest forwards, almost pigeon chested, so a real strong arch in the back. Don't let the shoulders round forwards so they're in front of the chest. Very, very important. And you'll feel a much better contraction if you if you take heed of that. So thanks for watching, guys. If you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to see more natural bodybuilding videos. Email naturalaesthetic at outlook.com for more info on online training. If you've got any questions regarding any training or diet that you want to see in, a, in an upcoming video, then just leave a comment in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. Stay strong.